Well, the Supreme Court has now warned the Sahara Chief Subrata Roy that he will be going back to jail by the 19th of June if he does not pay 2,550 crore rupees. Now, the Apex Court has also reiterated its warning that Ambi Valley will be auctioned off if the payments are not made in time. Uh, so another setback essentially coming in from uh, for Subrata Roy, also a very stern warning from the Supreme Court over there. Minakshi Banja on the phone line with me. Uh, Minakshi, give us more uh, details as to the observations of the Supreme Court. Well, uh, you rightly pointed out, this is going to be worrisome, worrisome uh, for Subrata Roy. Clearly, Supreme Court not in the mood to cut in any slack. And the particular observation that he drew from the bench today, when he made a per, per, private uh, personal appearance before the Supreme Court, because he was asked on an earlier occasion to do so, was as follows. We will be compelled to send you back to jail right from here itself if the checks that you submitted today are not honoured or realised. So clearly, mm -hmm. Supreme Court on very short fuse with Subrata Roy. He has got himself a mild breather uh, till the 19th of June when the matter comes for hearing next. But clearly, uh, the Supreme Court of the opinion uh, that, uh, like you again rightly pointed out, that Ambi Valley uh, will take the fall if at all there is anything wrong that goes with the checks of 1,500 crores that have been submitted by Subrata Roy before the Apex Court. Uh, what is very interesting is the Supreme Court has also gone ahead and it has fixed mm. the reserve auction price for Ambi Valley, uh, which right. has been valued at over 37,000 crore rupees. It has asked the official liquidator to start the process of drafting the terms and conditions and it has clearly today issued the last and perhaps the final warning that the checks that Subrata Roy has submitted before the so on a short Absolutely. leash there uh, from the Supreme Court, uh, Subrata Roy, thank you very much, Manakshi, uh, for bringing us all those details of the proceedings.